you know, there's just so much, Alex, you can learn from the greatest generation. I love visiting my folks, my grandparents, grandma, yeah. get so much history from them. My grandma is 102. What? And I definitely miss my grandpa seeing that. You've video. got some good genes there, yeah, lady. I do. She says we have <laughs> Good stock, that's what she says. <laughs> All right, so Pueblo waking up at 31 this morning. It's chilly for sure. I do think temperatures are warmer now. We got this update at seven. Uh, so I'm expecting it to be now into the upper 30s. And so far, winds are light today. Also highlighting Canyon City this morning, it's 41 degrees. No winds being reported right now. Humidity already down to 25%. So both Pueblo and Canyon City under red flag warnings today for the, their respective counties, as well as the San Luis Valley, including Alamosa. So those wind gusts will be 35 to 40 miles per hour in those zones. Humidity dropping less than 10%, so really dry air paired with the winter grasses that are still dead. Uh, anything that sparks a fire today could grow pretty quickly under those conditions. So we're just gonna be aware of this so that we don't start fires on accident. Now those wind gusts will be strongest between about 10 a.m. and 3, 4 o'clock. Then we'll, they will gradually start to diminish through this evening. I'm watching two cold fronts today. The first one's already moving through the state right now, and this one is really just going to fuel all the winds today. It's not going to give us cooler air yet, especially when we have a westerly component to the wind. That's downsloping and heating for us, so 60s and 70s in store today. But then around 4 to 8 o'clock, a cold front arrives from the east-northeast, and that brings in cooler air, a little higher humidity, so that's when our red flag warnings might be expired earlier than through 8 o'clock where they are in effect right now. But uh, it's not going to bring us precipitation yet, just a cooler start to next week. And you'll notice the temperatures stay cool all week long. Right now, temperatures starting in the 30s and 40s. This afternoon, we'll see lots of 60s and 70s out there. Cooler air further north because that cold front arrives quicker. Tonight, we'll drop to the 20s and 30s. And then by tomorrow, we're about 10 to 15 degrees cooler than today. More 50s and 60s out there. So looking ahead to next week, you'll notice cooler temperatures, cloudy conditions, and periodic chances for some precipitation. I I think the highest chance of seeing some good amount of moisture will be Tuesday afternoon and evening and some limited chances of rain after that. For Pueblo, I don't see you transitioning to snow Tuesday night. I see mostly just some flurries and rain and 50s and 60s for highs next week, feeling a bit more like a cool spring pattern. Canyon City, we're looking forward to 50s and 60s next week. Might even see a thunderstorm across the region on Thursday. For Woodland Park, I see mostly snow for you for the main precipitation type and those high temperatures in the 30s or low 40s, but overnight dropping to the 20s. We're gonna be right back with Sports Ahead today.